Hi, everybody. Um, so I, um, Ash is going to talk about our vision and our products and where we're heading as a company. And Kearns, Steve Kearns will also talk about stateful and stateless. Uh, but I just wanted to have an opportunity to just say a few minutes and uh, say uh, thank you uh, for using our products. Uh, my name is Shai Bannon. Um, I wrote the first few lines of code of Elasticsearch many, many years ago. Uh, one of the founders of the company. I was the CTO of uh, Elastic, the chief technology officer for many years. Uh, then I took over as a CEO uh, for a few years and recently I got demoted back to be a CTO. Um, uh, and I'm having a lot of fun. Uh, so Ash, uh, who was our chief product officer, became the CEO. Um, and, um, and I get excited about uh, focusing back on all the innovation that we are doing as a company. Um, I personally built Elasticsearch many years ago uh, with the vision of being able to put any type of data into a search engine and being able to explore it. And that's going to be very powerful. And the limit was limitless to a degree. Uh, it's up to your imagination to see where it can take you. Um, and the fun thing that I had over the years, and I remember you know, when we were a very small company and only a few people and we were running here in DC meeting with uh, companies that were innovating on top of Elastic is the level of innovation that happened here in the public sector. Um, two things come to mind. Uh, the first one was when we realized how much we were being used as a geo engine. You know, it's pretty unique to be able to go and have the freedom of search combining it with geo capabilities. And I still remember that evening when we walked here and we said, well, we have to figure out how to invest in geo because there's some really important systems out there that rely on Elastic uh, here in the public sector. Uh, and the next day, we went and tried to figure out how do we get the, you know, the foremost experts and really invest in the capabilities of Geo and uh, combining them together with search to provide the better service. The other one was security um, and, and cyber threats and cyber security. Uh, now, the nice thing about Elastic, by the way, and I'll take a step back, is the fact that we're built as a free and open, on top of open source foundation. Uh, and the amazing thing that happens then is that we never build a security product, but when we show here, when we show up here, we we'll suddenly talk to people and they would say, you know, I'm storing massive petabytes amount of data in security threats in Elastic and I'm using it for threat hunting. And I remember my first question was, why? Because uh, we we'll probably make it pretty hard for you <laughs> to store a massive amount of data because we didn't build a security product. We built a pretty sophisticated and capable search platform, uh, but we don't have the ability to you know, connect to security data sources and ship that data. We don't have built-in alerting rules, all the capabilities that you would expect to get from, uh, from a security product. And the answer was because nobody else can search our threats as fast as we need to be able to protect uh, the systems, the countries that we need. Uh, and that was a very humbling moment for me, first of all. Uh, it also showed that the level of innovation that happens here uh, in terms of the scale and massive amount of data that you need to deal with. And then obviously the next day we went to work and try to figure out how the hell do we go and build a security product to make sure that you'll be successful. Um, and you'll see a lot of the innovation that happened here. Uh, so one of the reasons why I enjoy so much coming over here uh, and Chris said it, is to listen. Uh, I'd love to hear what you're using our products for. I'm pretty sure that I'm going to surprise at least once every few minutes uh, in the level of innovation that you're doing with our products. Hopefully, you'll be happy with the progress that we made on the commitment uh, to some of the use cases that you've used. And obviously, we'll use this opportunity to figure out how do we commit to your success uh, in the future. So thank you very much for the user usage um, of our products, and we're here to support you. And I'll hand it over to Ash.